Hey, what's going on everybody? It's Garrett here, and we are back today in Farming Simulator 15, and in today's episode, we are going to cut down some more trees, and so what I'm thinking is, instead of cutting them down and cutting them into 8 meter lengths for this thing to do, I'm just gonna flop the whole tree right here. Honestly, because this thing can manhandle anything you throw at it, and that'll just be a whole lot quicker to do. Mm -hmm. So that's what I'm thinking for that. So I'm going to do a time lapse of me cutting down this whole row and then I'll check in with you guys once I'm done doing that. Alrighty guys, so now we've got a pile of full grown trees here, and so I'm going to chip these in the next episode, uh, but f for the rest of the episode, I wanted to round up all of the equipment that we've got to bring it back to the main farm so it's not all over the place, and we can do some nice um, screenshots or whatever at the end of the series. So I'm going to round up all of the equipment. And then, also in the next episode, what we're going to do, like I said, we're going to chip those trees and then also buy the helicopter. And then with what money we have left over, we will pay off as much of the loan as possible, just so we feel like we've been a little bit productive. But let me make sure I'm going the right way here. Uh, yeah, we're good. Alrighty, and then we'll turn down here again. Hopefully, I won't run into Victorian houses like I like to do all the time. Alrighty, and there is the agroforestry field. We got, I have to say, we have gotten more cut down in it than I thought we would. This is episode 18, so 
We've got two more episodes. One is going to be serious and one is not going to be serious at all. Uh, so, yeah, the last serious episode we will uh, air in two days at 7 o'clock a.m. Pacific Coast time. But, yeah, in that episode we're going to do the last serious things and then we're going to be on to non-serious things for the last episode. Because we want to let the last episode be nice and fun and easy going, so... Yeah, and then also, like I said, it was the last episode or the episode before that or something like that. Uh, I do have a very big surprise for you guys uh, what we're going to replace Farming Simulator with. Um, because this is actually going to be the last Farming Simulator series. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed it so far and will enjoy the two episodes to come. Because they're the last episodes of Farming Simulator we're ever going to do. So, yeah, that's the deal with that. So, yeah, the surprise is going to be real. So, I can't wait to uh, unveil that to you guys. Uh, it's coming soon. It's coming soon. So, I think we're going to have to go around to these railroad tracks in order to get that darn... Oh, man, this thing can drift. Get that darn trailer out logging trailer that didn't work at all and we're not even gonna be able to reach it from there okay I have another idea I'm not out of ideas just yet Whee! oh that's so cool oh man I that I wish I would have discovered that earlier that's so cool how you can drift this huge mining loader <laughs> like yeah <laughs> Oh, that's so cool. Okay, okay. All ridiculousness aside, let's actually get this thing out of here. You're supposed to come with me. Come on. Come on. You can do it and you know it. Okay, let's just back the truck in there and see if we can get it hooked up. Were we even close? Not really. Doggone it, we're close. We are close. Oh man, you have to be so exact. Try to move this trailer with the truck. There we go. Please don't glitch out. Thank you. Okay. Please? Please hook up. I'm literally right on you. Hmm, this is fishy. This is really fishy. Hmm, what if we, yeah, what if we just go like that? Haha, -ha, there we go. So we'll drive this back over to the main farm. Which should be very quick, because this truck is quick. That's a pretty cool locking rig, actually, I have to admit. Um, we're going... 
kind of the wrong way, but we're going to roll with it. Not going to make much of a difference in this truck. But anyway... Can we take a shortcut? Yep, we're gonna take a shortcut. Shortcuts always end up terribly, but we're gonna do them anyway. Perfect. Oh, nope, there's a fence there. Turn! Jeez. Learn to drive, Garrett, for crying out loud. Oh my goodness, okay. And of course, this grass field. If this grass field wasn't fenced, that would be so nice for all the shortcuts I take. They pretty much all run right through here. It'd be so nice if that field wasn't fenced. But it seems like in this map, they fence all of the grass fields, but not the regular fields. It's kind of weird. I'm going to leave the chipper truck out because um, we're going to use that in the next episode to haul all the wood chips. So that's going to stay there for now. Okay. Okay, work it on in here. I actually don't know if we're going to have enough slots. Yeah, we're not going to have enough slots to fit everything in just this one. In just this uh, storage shed. Sharp turns, sharp turns. There we go. Oh, I forgot about this. The sprayer. The sprayer that doesn't have a top. Actually, you know, we might as well sell this because I don't want to show this off at the end of the series without a top on it, and I'm not buying a top for it for any reason, so, yep, saw that. Okay, everything, oh, we still have this thing. This thing, and then, I don't, is the sapling planter? I don't know, no, this we sold the sapling planter, I forgot. Yeah, so then after this, I think all we have is the chipper truck, and the chipper, and the smart tracks, I believe. I really want to take a shortcut through the canyon, but this um, this tractor would never handle it. I don't think. No, I'm gonna do some drifts just cause. Wee! <laughs> oh, that's so cool. <laughs> In real life, this loader would have been on its side right there. Oh, this is, this is cool. I love farming simulator. It's like everything. All the tires are just like stuck to the ground. Like, no matter how much centripetal force you give it, it's never going to flip. Just because the, uh, the physics of the game have it just, like, stuck to the ground with, like, glue or whatever. Okay. Going through town, you know. You know, nothing to see here, just running into fences and drifting my loader through town. Nothing to see, you know. Normal everyday things. Normal everyday things. Yes. Of course. Normal everyday things. Okay. Red Hut. Is that a restaurant or something in the Midwest or something? Because I've never heard of Red Hut. Red. Oh, yes, it is a restaurant. Red Hut Cafe, it says. Hmm. It's kind of weird. They have a Toys R Us in this town, too, which I find kind of funny. Yeah, we're in the American Outback farming, and we got a Toys R Us in our town. <laughs> weird. Okay. I've always wondered what this is. Is it just, like, water? Oh, it's moonshine. I saw the sign. Moonshine, really? Water of life. Moonshine. Why would they have a full facility just for moonshine? Weird. I don't know why you'd need a whole facility of that for that. Because, I mean, 
You're not gonna be using that much moonshine. Really, you shouldn't be using any of it. Whatever. Well, there's a train. There's the train. Okay. So I think after this we'll have all of it. I think. I'm pretty sure. Drift in my loader. Ha <laughs> ha Oh. Completely reckless. Completely. Back in the sucker on in here. There we go. Set the bucket down. Pick it up a little bit. There we go. Alrighty, so let's check. We've got that, that, that. Uh huh. So all we have left is that stuff. Okay. So I think that's going to do it for this episode. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like because it really helps out my channel a lot. And if you really liked it, maybe think about subscribing to keep up to date with all of the awesome content coming out on my channel every single day. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode and until the next one, I'll see you later. Goodbye.